Hi YouTubers, just want to show you something in my King James Version Bible. It's like a study Bible, so you've got, you've got the scripture and then you've got notes and stuff underneath. Um, this is only a couple of years old or even less than that. But uh, nevertheless, we go to Matthew 9, 9 chapter 9 verse 17, where it talks about... Um, it says, Jesus says, Neither do men put new wine into old bottles, else the bottles break, and the wine runneth out, and the bottles perish. But they put new wine into new bottles, and both are preserved. Now, if you look down at the study notes, which uh, mention 917, it says, in the Bible times, wine was not kept in glass bottles, but in goatskins sewn around the edges from the watertight bags. New wine expands as it is fermented, stretching its wineskin. Mm, there we go, word wineskin comes up. So, after the wine had aged, the stretched skin would burst if more new wine was poured into it. New wine, therefore, was always put into new wineskins. Jesus used this description to explain that he had not come to patch up the old religious system of Judaism with its rules and traditions. His purpose was to bring in something new through it. Right, so. Well, we have the word bottles in the Bible now instead of wineskin. Wineskins. So. But the interesting thing is, if you look at the back of the Bible, which is the topic index, I'll just put a marker there so I don't lose the spot, um, and you look up the word wine, so it says wine, and then under it says new wine in old wineskins, and it has a reference to Matthew 9.17. Hmm, interesting. So... If you look new wine in old wineskins and you look up Matthew 9.17, which is where we just were, and we go double check, there's Matthew 9.17. Neither do men put new wine into old bottles. Oh, that's strange, isn't it? Even though in the description we see the word wineskins and as well as the back which is the um, general index which uses the word wine and then under that we have wineskins in a reference to Matthew 9.17 so that's interesting isn't it because as we can see in Matthew 9.17 in the actual chapter verse there's no such word as wineskins there anymore and we're all pretty sure that they used to be now we have bottles which doesn't make any sense because bottles don't stretch as the wine ferments it actually makes the wine better in bottles doesn't it when it ages and how do the bottles break and the wine runneth out and the bottles perish. Mm, yeah, no, it doesn't make sense, no. Yeah, very strange, isn't it? Well, as you can see, Matthew 9, 17, in the comments, it has, it explains how the wine is fermented, stretching its wine skin. After the wine is aged, the stretched skin would burst if more wine was poured into it. New wine, therefore, was always put into new wineskins. Something to think about. There's a lot more changes, but that's an interesting one.